Hey, my beautiful collective, welcome to Swift Intuitions. <laughs> it's the top of the morning or whenever you get this. Hey, if this is your first time on my channel, like and subscribe. If not, hey family, welcome back. So we're going to get into this energy of what spirit uh, wants you to focus on at this particular time and this particular moment. Most high, I thank you for my beautiful collective. I thank you for their life, their purpose, their very being. I ask you right now, anything that is hindering their growth, their knowledge, their rising, we ask you right now to uplift it and remove it. Victory is our portion. Anything that's rising us against us, let it fall down immediately. Victory is ours. We are the untouchables. All right, collective. Most high, what is it that our collective should be focusing on at this very moment? Messages of love, light, and power, 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 messages of balance, balance, okay. Right now, Spirit says there's a strong need to focus on service, and so I feel good when I can help others. Now, this card has been coming out a lot, so uh, Spirit is calling for us to really serve. I know, right? Yeah, but we have to serve the, the world right now with our our boom boom juice, our super hero powers. We have to heal the world and make this better place for you and for me. Well, yeah, I know. If you don't, go, go fuck with Michael, please. Go fuck with Michael. But yeah, the Spirit is calling us to bring about some type of service to the world right now. The world is hurting, hurting so bad. And they need, the world needs this nurturing. They need this healing energy that's coming together. People are waking up collective, just like you and I. We are awakened and loving it and just growing in our beautiful God energy. And Spirit says, as you begin to grow and get more powerful and confident in thyself, your true authentic self, you start to see how everything that used to mean something doesn't mean anything. Spirit says now it's time for us to start healing the masses. We have to start healing the masses so they can start the process. I mean, how we still in a process, but you know, we just went through a level up. So Spirit say, shoot, sure, you leveled up. That means so did your responsibilities. <laughs> You know what we're saying. Spirit says it's time to serve. So with that, with that energy, but it's something that's going, that's giving back because it's something that makes you feel good. Whatever it is that you do with your beautiful hands, that you do with your mind, that you create, Spirit says it's time to put that shit times a thousand. It's time to be on that straight up holy frequency. It's time to create. And... And spirit is calling you to create things that will serve, that will benefit humanity at this time. And I know some of the things we be talking about, y'all be scared with this fear. But spirit says it's nothing to fear but fear itself. Understand you are a very powerful being. And once you get into understanding and knowledge of that, then you can start operating in your power. You see what I'm saying? It's like... Let's just say, right? Let's just say there was a baby lost. Like, he just found a baby in the basket, right? And this whole time, this baby, you know, you take this baby in, you know, start raising the child, and dun, 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 dun. This child is raised up in your environment, you know? So they feel like they just like you. But let's just say some years go by, probably when the child hit 18, some people came looking for him with some guards. Ooh, we lost the baby about 18 years ago. Ooh, do you know anybody who picked him up? <laughs> and you like, wait, I picked up my son at 18, <laughs> 18 years ago. And they say, well, this, this boy is the king of everything. So we need him back. <laughs> So it's like this child had royal blood. So once once this child was in awareness of this royal blood, then this child could start activating the um, the things that come with that royal uh, responsibility or that obligation, right? And the truth is, Spirit says, you it's time for you to walk in who you know you are. 
it's time for you to walk in that royalness that you are. See, all up until this point, we were the black sheep of the families. We were the ones, the weirdos. <laughs> you know, the ones, the black, you know, we didn't take no shit. We didn't, wasn't a part of the illusion for the for most part. The spirit says now, the guards here, they coming to get you because you have a place. You have, you, you are a part of a bigger picture. Yeah, up until this point, yeah, look, everything was a lesson to get to your blessing. Now it's time for you to walk in who you were designed to walk in. And now since you know that you have royal blood, now that you know you have these privileges, it's like, don't you think the people that, that this person grew up with that could have picked on this person, don't you think they're going to feel some type of way now? That's what spirit is putting you in the energy of right now. The people who fucked with you up until that point that them guards came and said you was the king of, or the queen of fucking everything. How do you think them people felt at that point? At that point, they feared that what they did in the past would affect them in their present and their future. People are looking at you collective like, damn, I did not know collective was going to be who they are. I did not know that collective was going to be in a position that could potentially affect me if they remember the past. You see what I'm saying? And right now, Spirit says, look, some of these things that you are fearing that's coming to pass is your portion. And with that portion will bring along a lot of more, a lot more gifts. You have more room to do things that you like to do, but you can't be afraid of it. You can't be af afraid of what's yours. You can't be afraid of being who you are. Mm, messages of love, light, and power for my beautiful, powerful collection. See, look, and with them people I was talking about, look, they're going to be grieving because they lost something. They lost the opportunity to be around, uh, uh, be around royalty. That is it, spirit. These Spirit is saying, look, I'm calling you to serve at this time. So there's a lot of abundance coming in. And Spirit says, if there's an en a, 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 a energy of fear because of how great you are about to be a service to the whole universe, Craig, the universe. Spirit says, all of those fears, you, all of this right here, I realize that I'm being, that I'm testing my resolve to live in the energy of love. Look, look, you re Spirit says, if you release that energy of fear, you about to be somebody that the people that you grew up will start wondering if you remember the past. You hear me? You're about to be so important. You, you are so important. Which are about to be about to be nothing. You so important, family, that you have this great service to accomplish. You've already started. The very thing that you love to do, create that is helping people. That is what you have to put your energy into right now. Focus only on that. Nothing else. Nobody else. We don't pay attention to nobody else. Nobody else exists. That's why we don't never be in competition. People be compete with themselves. They be delusional, family. Ain't nobody fucking with them. Because ain't nobody fucking with us. <laughs> like, how you gonna fuck with me and I'm in a world of my own? Bitch, ain't nobody in this bitch with me but me. <laughs> you tripping. And because of that energy and because of this of this mass opportunity that's coming towards you, family, right now, a lot of people are going to be uh, grieving the loss of the opportunity to be around royalty. So with that being said, family, I love you. Love yourself. Spirit says prepare for this and understand that fear is only an illusion. We remove all the veils we see. All right. That's why we lead us. <laughs> we ain't welcome to no ditches, you feel me? I love you, love yourself.